Hi folks, I can't believe I just erased the last video. Uh, so we're going to start off with it being white. What I did was to take some white um, mixture of white uh, acrylic paint and um, water and mixed it and did the whole side. Um, and we're going to start with the red now. Um, do the whole candy cane, the top and everything. And then clean out your brush as good as possible. I'm going to try to clean that out a little better. Alright, now I'm going to try this again. And I'm going to do the boot portion online here. Um, I was explaining something on the other video and now I'm going to have to re-explain it again. Uh, I did over 200 videos plus and I never erased one by accident. That's the first. Oh well, there's first time for everything. But anyway, what I was describing on the other video, somebody asked how to order the videos. And if you are interested in ordering the pattern uh, for any of the videos, uh, what you need to do, I mean the video pattern, not the videos. Uh, what you need to do is go to the very first, say you want to do the wooden shoe. Go to that caption on the wooden shoe and go to the very first video and there will be a little caption um, in the beginning of the video explaining how much it is. It's, it's usually a dollar and a half and, um, and it will tell you who to pay it to at Zomer Enterprises uh, through PayPal. And if you go to that site, um, if you go to those that first video that will explain all that for you, okay? I don't repeat it in every video and it's, so it's the first video of every project I have that set up. The other place I also have it is on my channel, the Carver's Woodshop. Um, I have it in the left hand side under the description of my site and I'll start listing the prices there. Uh, every time I add something new it will go in that that list and that will also tell you where to where to um, where to pay it and all that. So all of it's a dollar and a half. It's not real expensive. They're all my own creations and um, we are um, you know I've got about ten up now. I also have a couple of new ones that I'm not going to do on YouTube because it's kind of a repeat of some of the stuff. I have a couple of new Santa uh, for the relief just like the Santa and the bear one. Um, the thin one which is about an inch thick and you can uh, order those. I'll show you what they look like um, after I'm done with this and show you exactly um, where to order that stuff if you're interested. Okay, there's plenty of projects to do. I try to make them simple for the beginner. Uh, if you're a beginner, please do not be discouraged if your carving does not turn out exactly as you see here or um, you know, uh, or you make a mistake. Uh, I just made a couple mistakes uh, while carving. I was going to do a project and it just would not work for me, folks. I tried it once and I thought, oh, I'm going to go to something simpler just to, you know, make it easy for me for a little bit. And uh, so I thought of this boot that seemed like a lot of fun to do. And um, notice the top of the boot's going to look a little darker because that's going to be soaked into the wood. That's okay. That's not a problem. So we're going to do the bottom portion here yet. We're going to do the whole thing because when you hang it in the tree you're going to be able to see it all. Uh, I don't know if that white's dry enough for me to finish up the candy canes because I think I'm going to redo this boot one more time. Um, to blend it in a little bit here. And uh, this is a mixture of water and red paint. And a little bur bit of burnt uh, sienna with it. So, uh, I will be starting my classes here in in September um, shortly, and um, it's going to be fun. Um, I may not have it here at the farm. I may have it at our local mall. I need to talk to our manager up there and see if I can do that. They gave me permission before. I worked there as an armed guard, so they said it was fine if I wanted to take an evening and take a couple hours um, to do it. So that might be what I might end up doing this fall just to get started. Now, um, we're going to let this um, dry up a little bit and then I'm going to be back.
to finish up the candy cane. Okay, I need to dry this a little bit, so I'm going to go to the hair dryer, and you can use that at a low setting to dry it. All right, I'll be back.